great grandpa is on the my far right, grandma next to him. Weston is the child that she's holding. Aunt Fern is holding, oh, just a minute, Elvin, El Eldon. And her husband, Burdette, is next to him. Um, the second to the back row would be Uncle Hans. Behind Grandma would be Aunt Fern, and next to her, my mother, Isla, in front of uh, Grandma Jackson's house in Teasdale. And this would be about 1928, 29, or 30. My dad, Blaine Abraham. Uh, next to him is Larry Blaine Abraham. And the, and the little guy would be Michael Jackson Abraham. This would be in Teasdale, Utah. Grandpa and his camper in uh, Granger, which is now West Valley City. My grandma and grandpa, Leonard. Leonard, Leonard, Leonard right. and Florence Abraham. This is my dad's brothers and sisters. It would have to be in Kanosh. And he looks to about 12. He was born in 1917. My dad, uh, Blaine Abraham, his brother, Dale, this would be my grandmother Jackson's mother and dad. This is my dad in Pennsylvania. They took a trip to see Uncle Weston. My dad in front of their house in Granger, Utah, which is now West Valley City, Utah. My dad in the front room of West Valley City and my mother in the rocking chair. My dad in Teasdale, Utah, in front of Grandpa's garage. My mother, Isla Jackson Abraham, in her home in, in West Valley City. My, my mother, Isla Jackson Abraham, and Lisa Nelson. My dad, Blaine Abraham, holding Shannon Abraham, about six months old. Brother Michael, he was getting ready to go on a mission. Brother Alan, Roger Abraham, and Shannon. This was a family reunion down by Kanosh. This is my mother's 40-year reunion uh, notice in the paper. Brother Larry, Blaine Abraham, Diane Abraham, and Elaine Abraham, uh, when we lived on 8 South in Salt Lake. My Grandpa Abraham built this house for my grandma's father. That's how he met her, just above Teasdale, Utah. Right. This is a float my mother made when we first came to uh, Granger, Utah, or West Valley, Utah. She was a, a, a primary teacher. Brother Larry, when he was about 18 months old, he got spinal meningitis. Right after that, was very sick. Uh, in front of Grandma Jackson's house in Teasdale, Utah, uh, that from my right, Uncle Jewel, and back of him, my dad, Blaine Abraham, in front, uh, Aunt Reva, and back of Aunt Reva is my mother, Isla. Uh, in the middle is Grandma, Ida May, in back of her is Han Uncle Hans uh, Jackson. The redhead in front of him is Golda, his wife, and next to her is Aunt Fern. Uh, in front, sitting down, is Uncle Weston. Larry's first wife, Linda, is on my right, on your, my right, the white dress. In back of her is Alan. Crockett Rushton, Diane Abraham Rushton, Isla Jackson Abraham, Alan Roger Abraham, Larry Blaine Abraham, and Elaine Nelson. We're sitting in front of the lawn at the uh, 4264 South 4000 West House. Okay, my mom and dad got married in the temple on this day in front of Grandma Jackson's house in Teasdale, Utah. Ida Mae Jackson, my dad, uh, Blaine Abraham, me, Diane Abraham Rushton, Glenn Allen Rushton, and Shannon Abraham Weber. Uh, in my mom's front room in West Valley, Tracy Ann Rushton, Shannon Abraham Holding, Shereen Abraham Leslie Nelson, next to her Lisa Nelson and Glenn Allen Rushton. Uh, mom's backyard on, in the West Valley house, my mother's school picture, she was a school teacher, uh, Isla Jackson Abraham. Larry was in band in Valley Junior High School. 
uh, they performed in the uh, uh, July 4th parade. We had a, uh, they called it Norgeesta festival with all of the stakes in the, our entrance was Pioneers and Indians. Uh, Elaine sat in front, Greg Cable, Michael Jackson, Diane Abraham Rushton was the other pioneer. At my mom's house, so Diane and Glenn are the first, mom in the middle and Shannon on the left. Uh, mom, it was Halloween and I had made Shannon a costume as a rabbit. Grandma Jackson's house, uh, Diane on the right, Shannon, my mom, Tracy Ann, my grandma Jackson, and uh, the boy is Glenn. Uh, okay, Shannon, Lisa, and Glenn, and I'm not sure where they were. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know about this one. <laughs> if she were alive, I would. <laughs> Who's that? Elaine Abraham Nelson. She was probably in the seventh grade. If I'd known where this was, I'd have blackmailed her. Okay, this was in Teasdale, and uh, uh, Aunt Carol and Uncle Terry were living in a trailer in our yard. Okay, there, Elaine and Diane tending Susan. Susan was Aunt Carol's oldest daughter, and she passed away quite early. She had cancer. Oh, that's all we said. She died in her 40s. But we enjoyed tending her. She was cute. In the background was my dad's truck. He bought that to go logging with my grandpa, Jackson. In the back of, of the house in the back of the truck is uh, Aunt Fern and Uncle Burdett's in Teasdale. Do you want all these little ones? No, it's a few. Isla, Abraham, Shannon, Elaine, and Lisa. Right. You gotta do that one. <laughs> <laughs> I wish you were here. <laughs> Elaine Nelson in probably the eighth grade school picture. This is my dad and I think this was after my mom passed away and he got awfully lonesome. He was really good. He'd spread the tablecloth out or a, a dish towel out on the tablecloth so he wouldn't get his newsprint on the tablecloth. This is a little girl that was in my mom's kindergarten class and she was in foster care and my mom my mom felt so bad for her she wanted to uh, adopt her. Her name was Roberta. Uh, it didn't turn out that she could adopt her. Her father was in the military, and they would not let mom adopt her, even though uh, Judge J. Allen Crockett got involved in that process. But they said no, since the father was in the military, they would not let her be adopted. This was at a Thanksgiving dinner that uh, Linda Watkins Abraham was uh, in the middle as Diane, and mom was cooking Thanksgiving dinner. This is my mother shortly before she passed away. At her house? Yes, she did. Yes, she passed away at her house. I, uh, it was my turn to tend her. I think I told you this story. And I didn't want to go, but I, it was my turn, so I went and we, I held her and she talked to me and she, right before she passed, she says, oh, it hurts too bad. And I ran out to get daddy, who was out. Uh, in the yard, he says, I've got to have a break, because I've been with her day and night, and I haven't slept. So he was Henri, didn't want to come in, but he came in, and he grabbed her and held her. She would say, I'll take two steps, and you take two steps, while she was passing. And Daddy gave her the best blessing I've ever heard him give anybody. And then she passed in his eye, in both of our arms. And right then the sun shone in in the, in the west window. Just sunbeams all, all over mom. It was beautiful. It was absolutely beautiful. This was the backyard of the uh, Granger house. Daddy, Elaine, and Lisa, Alan, and Diane. My mom, Isla Jackson Abraham, and my grandma, Ida Mae Jackson. My mom, working her garden, she planted beautiful roses, but she's getting ready to plant flowers. This was the day Alan was going on his mission. So there's Larry, Michael, Daddy, and Alan at the, I think it looks like the Salt Lake Temple. This is when Elaine brought Alfred home. Alfred J. Nelson, Alfred John Nelson, Larry Abraham, Michael Abraham, and Alan Abraham. Alfred bought a Cadillac and wanted to show the boys. 
Mm-hmm. Are we done this one? <clears throat> uh, Mom went on vacation down to southern Utah and she, she took Shannon and Roberta. This is when we went down to help Grandma with her yard work and Ian Nelson and Grandma. This was before my dad and mom got married. They, uh, mom worked in southern Utah in Zion's Canyon, and daddy went down to visit her. And that's a picture of them having a day out. Mom, getting ready to do her ironing, this is the way she sprinkled her clothes. She had a little sprinkle on top of the bottle. This is mom coming home from the hospital after she learned she'd had cancer. It's wedding, we've got the family all together, three boys and one daughter, uh, and grandma and grandpa. And we also have Tracy Ann and her daughter Cheyenne at the wedding. This is my sister Elaine's wedding. She had it at my mother's house. She was just out of high school, just barely out of high school. My mother made her wedding cake. It was beautiful. This was uh, the creepiest picture I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> this is, <laughs> I want to know the backstory. <laughs> I don't know. We went to see Santa Claus. I think Santa Claus imbibed a little bit before we came. But that's me when I was probably four years old. And I think that's the one I look like, my little Molly. Larry, Elaine, and Diane. Okay. It's a cute picture. It is cute. This was a... Thanksgiving, Mom invited all of the family. Uh, Aunt Carol on the right, Mom next to her, me in the middle, where they're joking, telling stories about me. Aunt, uh, um, hmm, it has to be Shirley, uh, Daddy's aunt by me, and uh, her back turned to me was Linda Watson, her Larry's first wife, and Elaine Nelson, making fun of me. <laughs> what were they saying about you? <laughs> this is my mother in her house and her mother, Ida, Ida Mae Jackson. Uh, she came to stay with us for a little while after her husband died. Oh, that's cute. This is Shannon and Tracy in southern Utah. We uh, took Shannon to help tend the kids, but she I think she had more fun than the kids did. That's my mother uh, just before she graduated with her two-year degree from Southern Utah University. And that's my mother. Uh, apparently, she was going to a dance. That's in my Grandma Jackson's front room by her piano. This is a picture of my dad's uh, work buddies. He worked for Garrett. He uh, drove a truck. He's the first one on the right. I had an uh, accident, uh, uh, some kids in a convertible ran in the back of his semi-truck and they were badly, badly, badly hurt and he could not drive after that. So we, my grandpa had a sawmill in Teasdale, decided they would go buy semi-trucks and go down and haul logs for grandpa. However, it was the winter of 49, all through the state, all through the nation was a horrible snowstorm. Didn't it lasted till March? They couldn't get in Boulder Mountain to get the logs out, so Daddy had to come back to Salt Lake for a job. Oh, that's my little Glenny playing. That's my little Glenny. It's probably two, and it was Christmas, and we. Had that's Glenn and my brother Alan riding Alan's motorcycle. Uh, Glenn loved it, so when he grew up, he bought a motorcycle. That is. Elaine and I, and we had Pal, just had puppies, and we're holding Pal's puppies. You'd think we would have named her something else, but we named her Pal. She was a little Cocker Spaniel. She uh, ran under, she took her puppies and ran under my dad's car in the winter. My dad pulled out and they ran over her and saved the puppies, but she did not make it. That was the trip. <laughs> Grandpa Abraham took us on a little trip, and I think we took Dorothy Walk with us. And uh, my brother Alan and I, Glenn was just tiny, and Daddy said, come on, come on, we're gonna go on this trip. And of course, Glenn was in diapers, and I said, okay, but we need to stop for disposable diapers, but he would not stop. So every stop we made, we washed out diapers. 
and hung them wherever we could. Some we hung just in the window of the car to get them dry. We hung them wherever we could. That's Glenn and Lisa in Grandma's backyard. Oh, that's me at graduation. Graduated Granger High in 1961. Turn it around and it's still 1961 on your ring. <laughs> You're beautiful. Oh, I, I, I was good. I was okay. That's me and Elaine in Kenosh. We were staying with Grandma Abraham while my mother went to school to, to renew her teaching certificate. My brother Larry and me and Michael, ah, Greg Cable and Michael. That's us in Teasdale at Grandma Jackson's house. Glenn, Tracy is behind in a little carrier, so she was just months old and Glenn was two. Alan and me and Glenn, and he was not happy. He gets in front of Grandma Abraham's house. Glenn loved his little sister. We just brought Tracy home, so it would be in June. She was born June 5th, but we didn't get her till June 10th. She was a little bit premature. But Glenn was ready to take her over, be his their, her, his best friend. That was on our, our, uh, house, our property in the little white house on 5200. That's me in sixth grade. I got a perm, but we couldn't go back often enough to get a short haircut, so that's how I lived. That's me in about third grade. I still had that space between my teeth that embarrassed me so much. That's uh, that was Halloween at Monroe Elementary School. That was, I'm thinking either my mother or Aunt Reva's graduation uh, from Cedar. That's my mother's. I think that's in Teasdale, Utah. Okay, um, <clears throat> Daddy had a friend. He'd call him Harrison. That was his last name, and I can't remember his first name. And uh, they decided to go gold hunting. They were going to find the Dutchman's uh, Dutchman's mine. mine. And so that's my dad on my right. Uh, Harrison's son standing on the rock and Larry on the left and they took the Jeep that was daddy's Jeep and they pulled that trailer they put a mattress on top of the trailer and that's where the men slept and the slept and the boys had to sleep on the ground that's Larry uh, it's in Salt Lake and look at the old cars Larry was born in 1939 and the cars were older than that it looks like but they came to Salt Lake and they had an apartment on Vising Court in Salt Lake that was my brother Michael. He set up that mirror. He, he was quite artistic. He put the mirror in the wheelbarrow and decided he would take a picture like that. That is my brother Michael. And that's <coughs> Pal. That's Sydney and Michael's wedding. That's Shannon and Glenn. Shannon thought Glenn was hers. Probably at Uncle Alan's house. That's Tracy with her baby Matt, and she loved that Matt. That's at our house. That's uh, uh, Rushton's Rachel. mother, Rachel. Dad used to tease, and I don't show this, but he'd say, oh, she's easier to jump over than to walk around. And this is Rachel, and I don't know who the lady standing is. We were up at uh, Cascade Springs, and we took all the kids and they loved it, and Mark was a clown, so he had to get up on the car, and that's Matt and Tracy and me. Oh, Shannon and Tracy and Alan. But it does look like Tracy, so it must have been me and Tracy doing something. Looks like panning for gold. Okay, on my right is Uncle David and Maretta and, uh, and uh, Crockett. Alan Crockett, and uh, probably Russell, his brother. And that's in Uncle Alan's house on it's not 8th Avenue, it's 8th. 13th. 13th Avenue. And to my right is Uncle Dave, um, Uncle Russell, uh, Maretta, Judge Crockett, Grandpa, Harold Rushton, Maretta Rushton. Oh, that was in the paper from Kennecott. Uh, it's advertising savings bonds as I read it. Davey Hatton, Ralph Hatton, Teddy Hatton, Maretta Hatton, and Dave Hatton the Dead. Genevieve's house on Redwood Road. Uh, they, uh, they, Genevieve, the, the kids would stay with her a lot. That was uh, Grandma's sister. Oh, that's our little Tracy. I think we took her over when they were getting school pictures, and I think you got a school picture, and, and since I was the secretary, I think we took her over too. So oh, that's me and uh, Debbie's 
kids. That was uh, Carrie's wedding. Oh, we rode the train uh, like uh, the Hebrew Creeper or something. By I know the Hebrew Creeper. There. Oh, we went to Dinosaur Land, and that's me and Mark. Oh, sugar. Aunt Carol sent that picture. How come you have it? She sent that to me and says, "Just uh, do you remember this?" This is you. Yes, that's me. Yeah. And that's Elaine. It's a cute we shot. We were so darn skinny. Look at our knobby knees. <laughs> so darn skinny. Me and Debbie. Oh, is that? Yes. That's me and Debbie. I've always yes. loved your look that's, on this one. Well, that's when I used to wear those hair, the, the, the hair bands and I was 20 when Debbie was born. <laughs> that's our cute little Matt and Grandma had a hat for him. And that's Grandma Meredith Rushton. That was in Shannon's wedding and Tracy was a bridesmaid. She hated her hair. She, everybody she's talked to at the wedding, she said, my mom made me wear my hair that way. That was Glenn and Tracy. I didn't realize you were so much taller than her. Yeah. And uh, Alan and Diane and Mark. It's Does that Mark. look like Wheeler Farm? It's Mark. Yeah, yes, it looks like it, Willard Farm. Okay, that Mark, <clears throat> uh, Mark uh, I had attended uh, in the summer at Wheeler Farm while I worked. <gasps> That's Alan and Glenn, just learning to walk. That was on our, our little white house. And that's Glenn. See, there's Aunt Stella's fence. Yep, it's still down. there. No, it blew down. Well, half of it did. Oh, yeah. Glenn's taking himself for a walk. Uh, that's our, uh, we traded in the van for a, uh, what do we call it, a wagon? What do they call it when it had Station wagon. Station wagon. And that's how much it snowed that year. That is Glenn and Tracy and I walking uh, by the Bridalville Falls. That's Glenn. Before Tracy, he got all the toys on Christmas. <laughs> Every toy. And that, I love that shot. That's Glenn in our little white house. In my high chair? In your high chair, in our teeny little kitchen. Glenn, I think at Liberty Park. Yeah, I love Liberty Park. But that slide was a killer. It went up probably, <laughs> what would you say, twice the size of a man. And it was all metal, so it was hot, hot, hot. But uh, yeah, the kids loved it. And to climb up was just a killer. That's still Glenn in the snow. That is Glenn learning to use the rifle. Grandpa in his fields used to be, uh, uh, had water. Yeah, and that was but describe his, the, what's from the background. This was impressive. That, that's, uh, this is our house. Well, and that's Sandberg that's house, Elementary. But you can see the mountain, there's no other houses. Did you see Sandberg Elementary there? You can see that through the field. They just barely built that. Oh, it is right there, isn't it? Yep, yep. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, no houses. And there's, and there's house. John's house and the car. And his little dune buggy thing in the back of the car. Oh, what? I remember yeah. this thing. That was, was the, the horse uh, barn. The horse barn. I loved that thing when I was a kid. Oh, did you? Yeah. And there is Glenn and That would be Nathan. Nathan. And Nathan learning to walk. Oh, that looks like a gangster. <laughs> Alan. Oh, that's Glenn's school picture. I and there's Glenn back in our little white house in your leopard jammies. <coughs> oh, there's Glenn and Todd. Wouldn't Ludell Reese? We had a, a, a family reunion, and that's Glenn. That was irrigation day. See, I thought you play in the irrigation water. <laughs> there's Grandma look, looking shocked, and there's me with that's watching a, that's you play. That's a grandma's house, though. Yeah, and there's Grandma and Glenn, and they were at our house. That is the uh, um, Bryce Canyon. Glenn and I are looking at the Bryce Canyon. That is one of the first That's the pictures. favorite shot I've ever yeah, had. That's one of the first pictures Daddy took of you. And he loved that picture, and I love it too. And there we are playing with your uh, little, what were they called? Uh, I have no prize idea. <laughs> house thing in our little white house. You can see the chairs. And this, and this is the stereo I gave to you, and you don't remember it. That was, oh, shoot. We went down to Boulder Mountain, so where's the, 
Where did we go? This is down by the, the falls then. Yeah. This is Shannon, me, and Tracy in the background. Yeah. That was in t just down from Teasdale. We took a ride down through the and that's our Glanny with his hair. And that was uh that see the high chair you were in? I love that. It was just a chair that's sitting on the table, <laughs> but you had to have a good sturdy table for it to sit on. But you could take it with you. And that was at Grandma Jackson's house. We went down to help her take care of her yard. And that was our Volkswagen with Glenn, with me, Glenn, and Shannon. That was, and that was at... Uh, that's you and us. And that's Dad and Retta and me sitting in Grandma's house. Oh, that was me. That was a wedding of one of Elaine's friends. Uh, Red and Harold was often in the paper. They were uh, they helped start the uh, home and garden show. Uh, they were one of the first people that started it, and they uh, were the uh, grandma was the floral judge and grandpa was the floricultural judge. There's Glenn at grandma's house. We gave a tea set to grandma. Uh, it's grandpa in his greenhouse that's been torn apart now. Yeah, Todd and I used to play army men in there. That's my Grandma Jackson's house in Teasdale. I love that house. This is a Thanksgiving dinner down uh, Grandma, uh, Grandma Isla's basement. Uh, I'm holding Glenn and Linda, Larry's first wife, is holding Tracy. Uh, there's, that's down in Teasdale. <laughs> Look at Dad's pot already. He wasn't that old. <laughs> uh, Hell's Backbone is down below Boulder. It's, it's, it's on the boulders. Yeah, yeah. And there's Dad in the lake. I tell you that we go fishing. Farron? Is there a Farron? Be a, there's a Farron Reservoir. Okay, it's it's built for handicapped people to get out on. Oh, that's cool. It's a fun, a fun lake. Oh, that's my Grandma Jackson and Glenn and me looking down at Glenn. Glenn was the honor student. <laughs> Somebody cut his hair. I don't know who, and it looks... Uh, that's okay. the same slide, remember? Yes, and we went to Olympic Park, and it was right after, or right before Alan went on his mission, and he took him on that slide. Yeah, Alan and I were inseparable for a long time. You were, you were. Okay, that was when we went to see Santa Claus, and you really, really didn't want to go. <laughs> so, uh, I think you're, I put you back up on the line, and I think you were getting ready to run. <laughs> <laughs> to run? <laughs> That's Moretta and Jenny. That's Moretta. Yes. And who are these ooh. two? Then? Well, one of these would be Jenny because she's five years older, and this is Jenny. And it's got to be Lorraine. Might and be. Her daughter. I don't know who her daughter is, though. Huh. So. Wasn't Rita always beautiful? That was on Dad's mission. They sometimes did not see the seriousness of, of proselyting. <laughs> Looks like it was quite serious yeah, to me. That, that is dead, and, and I don't know who he's got in the pot, but it looks like there's problems. <laughs> uh, that's on Dad's mission. He went to Montana, the Western States mission. It was a, a big area at the time. Is that me blowing on fire? I think it's you. Okay, See? I took the girls to camp. It probably <laughs> isn't me, but we were learning how to make fire with a flint and steel and everybody had to get their fire started. And that looks like Marietta. That's definitely dad. Look at his jawline. That's definitely dad. That's dad. From high school? Well, he didn't. He wouldn't have his picture taken when he graduated from college, so it's got to be high school. That's in the legislature, I think, the first uh, term in the legislature. That's when uh, that goes with the, when we took the the Volkswagen van down to Grandma's and helped her with her yard work. And that's that's in Aunt Stella's cabin, and it's Aunt Virginia and Art. Uh, Art, Art. Is that old blue in the picture? That is definitely old blue. That's and Tracy. That's Tracy. And what were you doing down there, huh? Oh, it's a. And that's in Aunt Stella's cabin. And that's uh, uh, Aunt Stella by the refrigerator and Grace. And my Aunt Grace. Mm -hmm. That's Dad at work. Uh, they took that picture when he was running for, for office. That's Dad and... That's in Teasdale. Ethan. No, that's at Boulder Mountain. 
Yeah. Well, he's down. Yeah. And that's Older. Ethan. And oh my goodness, that kid rolled that trice around the circle, around, around, around until people were absolutely going to kill him. But he enjoyed it. That's when Dad was cooking all that food for everybody. And oh man, people liked it. He made his black forest cake and his. Oh yeah. I can't remember what all. And that is Mark. Yep. Deer hunting, apparently. Okay. Oh, this is was our cute little missionary Sarah. And she liked to stay here because nobody could find her down the lane. And that's <laughs> me and Mark in the back and Dad and Sarah. Oh, that could be Molly. It's certainly not Tracy. That, we bought that little tricycle that Ethan rode around on Boulder Mountain that drove people crazy. That was one of his birthday presents. We had a birthday here at our house for him. Uh, Mark made that costume for Halloween. He made it all by himself. He got the paint out. He used a bottle holder for the front buttons. He used an ice cream bucket for the hat, I believe. I can't remember. But he came up with that all by himself, and then he put uh, uh, dry that flexible tube in use for dryers and we put some white gloves on him and he was a robot. Oh, this is uh, me sitting on the piano and uh, uh, his name is John John. Uh, and this is Eileen's husband, so it would be Dave Colette. And the, the, the boy I'm holding would refer to himself as John John. This is in Grandma's yard. Uh, that She had a, a swing out in the back and she'd swing with, it looks like Mark. <laughs> this is Mark, and and uh, Martha's always had this I'll show you type look. <laughs> oh, this is Grandma with Mark and Matt. What's Mark holding? A cat? Oh, and this is that cute picture we took with uh, Grandma and Mark and Matt and Nathan and Sean. This is Halloween, of course, and I dressed up for Halloween in my Halloween sweater, and Mark dressed up as a devil, and little Ethan dressed up as a devil too. Like, oh, that's our Glenny. Uh, and I think it's Brighton. Okay, that's Dad. That's definitely fishing. Um, it looks U like Ida, or is it Ida? Or, uh, no, it's it's UNS. Okay. And Tracy should be there somewhere. Not if it, not She's if we right were tending. There. Oh, so, holding on to Dad. That's Tracy right there. Yeah, the purple pants. Yep. That's all I can see. There's Tracy, our cute little Matt. He was a cute kid. That's in front of our White House with our weeping willow tree. Oh, and there's Glenn in his favorite picture with his diaper <laughs> falling off because he was he was swimming in the swimming pool. <laughs> there's his swimming pool. Because it looks like cloth diapers, huh? And that's Glenn up. Uh, we went camping, and that mountain still had snow on it. We hiked way up. It was in the Uintas. We didn't, we didn't rent it. We just looked at him. That's not a... Houseboat. It's not That's a houseboat. bigger than a houseboat, I can tell, right? Oh, that was Coeur d'Alene. Oh, was that Coeur d'Alene? That was Coeur d'Alene, <clears throat> yes, yes. And, and Mark was just tiny. And remember we had to go like 100 miles an hour. Oh, yeah, he got pink eye. That lake. Got yes, Mark got pink eye, and Dad was in a meeting, and we were supposed to meet him at Port, uh, at Port Lake. And we were late because we picked up Mark from the hospital, or the doctor. And uh, we, we did, we went 95 miles an hour to get there. Okay, it looks like we're backpacking, but why was I carrying such a big backpack? And we did, oh, and that's where the picture where the, the snow was still on the mountain. Oh, that's Aunt Stella and Uncle Fred and you coming to see them. And Uncle Fred had put you on his knee and sing a, a, a sweetie song. I can't remember how it went, but you loved it. You loved it. That is, I remember the trip. It was in I Canada. I think that was in Canada. Yeah, I think it was too. Oh, that's my little Ethan when he had lice. Both he and Cheyenne had lice, but Cheyenne's mom went and got her a, a, a good shampoo, and Ethan's dad just shaved his head. That is, is that Mark and Ethan? Okay, that is Mark and some girlfriend. No, that's Mark and Nathan. That's not Nathan. That is most definitely Nathan. That, that's Nathan? That's me in, uh, uh, oh, what's the cave? Penogus Cave. Oh, that's my Mark, isn't it? Does it say Mark? It doesn't say Mark. This is your baby, Alan C. Rushton, 
Yeah, it's Mark. That's Mark. Yes, that was in the hospital with Mark. Yes, thank you. That's Mark. Grandma's house, it looks like, on her couch. That's Mark. I think that's when we were in Canada. <laughs> and that's uh, the Russian clan. Because that's uh, Rachel. It's Rachel, and is that my great grandpa? I've never seen a picture of him. Oh, mm -hmm. I guess I have, but that doesn't look like him. That looks kind of like Harold, but that's Grandma's house after they build on. So, yeah, at first was just this much. Yep. The one you just sold? Yep. Uh huh. Oh, that's a cute picture. That's Todd and Mike and John and Mason. That's the flower show people. Oh. Of uh, Genevieve Folsom. Uh, she was a. She uh, was a writer for Salt Lake Tribune. That's how Grandma gets her pictures in all the time. And that's a cute picture. There's Carrie and Brett and Michael Rushton uh, that was in the paper to advertise the flower show. <laughs> oh, that's uh, Brett's kids. Yeah. Christine, Martha, Sarah. This would be Sarah, Rachel, and Naomi. That was Shannon on her wedding day. Shannon and Cleo. Gorgeous bride. Alan and Christine, Martha, and Sarah, and Britt on Shannon's wedding day. Uh, we took these kids to the zoo. There's Tracy and uh, Jacob and Cheyenne, and look at there, that's... I love that picture. That is cute that we had a, some, some kind of, yeah, some kind of <clears throat> reunion, didn't we? That was you in... That's Tracy. Oh, was that Tracy? That's Tracy I thought going you the, were that... The garage door on the, that blizzard. That snowing day. And <clears throat> it wasn't that high, but the it, wind just... All the snow? Could, snow? Yeah. All the, all the snow came from garage, the fields and this covered this entire door. house. Oh, my god! And so but, Tracy and I dug a hole. Well, there was there was nothing to stop the wind from the... Yeah. You know, from, yeah, oh, they had to dig a hole to get out. <laughs> Oh, that's you and, oh, t uh, Tug, that's Tug. You know, I t talked about him. Mm -hmm. He's a, a tugboat operator. That's in Mexico. And that's your dad and me and Brett in... Uh, Port Pasco? Yes. This is in Canada for sure. When Tracy scratched uh, Mark and the man says, oh, she's a vicious. <laughs> <laughs> is that Mark, the baby? The baby's Mark Aww. and Tracy and Glenn. There's Tracy. She was a cute girl. You understand that's Jacob. You understand why she kind of <laughs> can't, uh, can't step back from that. That's Glenn and Tracy. Oh. Can you see them? They were adorable. Oh, oh okay. Oh, that's me after. Oh, that's that, a new one. Yeah, no, that we took a ride just before Dad died. Who's took that? A the, ride. Your cruise in Port Penasco? No. Oh, that no. No, no, no. Oh, oh, that's not in Puerto Penasco. I can't remember if we took a drive someplace. But yeah, no, that would be a beautiful ship, that, that our ship that, that we rode on. Uh, <laughs> I don't think it had a railing around it. <laughs> that's in Bryce Canyon with Glenn and Tracy and me. And that's, again, where we were helping Grandma with your yard work, and Alan helped me across the fence. Oh, cute. <laughs> And that's my grandma Jackson Aww. and Tracy. Oh, that's a cute. Isn't that cute? And the, the Volkswagen back there. So that's a Russian her grandma. That's Tracy. <laughs> that's quite a hairdo, huh? Boy, I can't remember that picture. Uh these are down to all the dad's half frames, so they're small. Yep, and that's it. That's Mark and Matt and me and Dad. Yep. Where is this at? It looks like it's in California when we went to visit Aunt Ida. Is that Boulder Mountain, do you think? That's, that's Mark. I think it's in Boulder Mountain, but I'm not sure. Or Capitol Reef. It does, but I made them some shorts. So that's Tracy, Mark, and Matt and Mark. Yeah, there's palm trees right there. Why did we go? What did we do in California? Kids. Now what's this? This is Canada. Oh no! You know what this, this is? Universal Studios. I know, and you know who they are? Uh, I just 
Yes, I just watched them the other day. And that, Beverly that's Hillbillies. Say, what's his name and Jeff and Jeffrey and yeah, the yeah. So that was a test. Universal Studios. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Jeb, right? Not Jeb, Jeb. Mark and Matt at that same old place. We don't know where it is, but I think it's Capitol View. That's that looks Matt. like a poop emoji. I know. <laughs> <laughs> don't ever tell me that. <laughs> yeah, that's him. Who is that? Matt. It was Matt. Okay, now this is where we went on a convention. No, it's the same place. Yeah. I think I think we went, oh look, we got the green. Uh, it's when I didn't go. Right, and we went to, where's Schoolhouse Road? <laughs> it was on Schoolhouse Road in, not Colorado. No, not Colorado didn't have palm trees. It's a palm tree. That's right, no, New Mexico? We were on, big, on a convention took the kids and all the ladies, oh, come with us. And I said, oh, I can, we got these two kids. That's gotta be on Blue Mountain, isn't it? You don't remember that? I don't remember that. You don't remember that bag? I don't. I don't. Little Matt and Tracy. That sign, that's, that's one place I've, they, that made me climb and I'm scared to death. Yep. <laughs> oh, that's oh, my wow. school picture. See how many kids crammed wow. into those classes, and now the teachers complain so much. We had to sit double in the in the in the desks. You both had to share a desk. All day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All day. See all those kids standing oh up. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Huh. Are you in that picture? And that was Charlene Kirby. She had horses, and she would ride horses <laughs> over to my house, and we'd go riding horses. So that's my wedding. You get a kiss Pam. from? Well, that's Pam, and that's Gloria. No, you're the one you get a kiss from. Oh, that's uh, Alan, my brother. Oh. And this is Michael, and that's John. You like that? That's no, that's just one of the neighbors. Oh, is this it? This is Grandpa and Grandma though behind them. That's dad. That's dad, isn't he handsome? No wonder, right? You know. Fell for him. Is that for a Uh yes, this is this is old old, old town Yuma. Oh. Just before just right after that, Miranda had heart palpitations and she fell over and we had to call the paramedics and they came and put a blanket around her. And in that restaurant? Her. In that restaurant. Oh my goodness. Yes, yes. And took her to the hospital. Yes. 